Hi, my lovely YouTube people. I am back with, of course, another hair review. Okay, so this wig is synthetic, of course. This one is by Free Tress Equal. This one is called Danity. That's the name of the wig, the style. And this is, I don't know if it's going to show up. It's actually backwards, but this is what the stock part looks like. Is supposedly their Brazilian natural it is not Brazilian it is definitely synthetic just so you know and this one is in the color OP 61327 um, now initially I saw this wig on another youtuber and that is Montana De um, Delion here on YouTube and she has a really great channel you guys should check her out I'll leave her a link for her uh, channel below but initially I saw her rocking this wig, um, I believe on her Instagram, and then I saw her post a video um, on her channel about it. So I was like, oh my God, I really loved how it looked. So I was like, I gotta pick it up. So I went and I picked this one up. I actually bought this one from wigstight.com. And um, before I even go further into the wig, I'm gonna go ahead and show you a um, what the inside of the cap looks like so that you can get an idea of how it's made. Okay guys, I wanted to show you the um, construction of the cap and the parting. Um, I put some foundation in the part. You can see it right here. Put a bit of foundation in there. The part is pretty good. It's like I believe an L part. And this is the inside of the cap. What I don't like about the cap is I'll explain. You know, regular adjustable straps in the back it has a comb in the back the thing I don't like about it is that it only has two combs right here there aren't any combs on the side on either side on the sides so if you want to keep your wig secure you're going to have to use bobby pins or something like that but I do like the fact that it ha does have the um, the dark root on the edges all the way down on the side because a lot of wigs don't have that it's only like right in this part right here so like if the wind blows and you see it's not matching so you'd have to take something like a, a marker or some makeup eyeshadow something to try to match that but that's the inside of the cap okay so see the cap I, I really like this wig it is a little bit shiny so I would suggest either you use some baby powder on it or you could use some dry wig shampoo I haven't tried the uh, dry wig shampoo method but I've heard other youtubers talking about that to take down the shine so I'm going to give that a try um, the sparting the parting space on this is pretty decent it's not bad I, I did you know as you saw I used um, foundation um, I also cut a little bit of layers in the front because it was longer so I kind of just cut it to you know frame my face um, the wig is relatively long, um, comes down just below the boobage, um, as far as like the back, you can see it's pretty long. I've been wearing this wig, um, for about, let's see, about a week now I've been wearing this, and I really, really do like it. I think it's really cute. I love the style on it. Um, the one thing about her is that she does shed a little bit. And she does um, actually tangle a lot too, but it's not too bad. I mean, you know, it's synthetic. You're gonna get that with synthetic wigs. But I really do like this wig a lot. Um, I like the color on it. <sighs> of course, I love the dark root. It's it's you know, like I said, it's really cool that they have the um, dark root all the way around on the edges because a lot of the wigs do not have that on it. So like when the wind blows, it shows all your business. And then you would have to go and take like a marker or, you know, some uh, eyeshadow powder or something to try to camouflage the sides a little bit so it'll blend um, with your hair if you have actually dark, um, dark hair. So, I mean, you know, I would say I would give this wig maybe out of uh, five stars, I would probably give it about maybe three and a half. You know, I, I like it, but one thing I don't like about it is that let me get down so you can see a little bit it has like this kind of like a little bit of a hump 
and I guess like if you turn the wig inside out it would kind of get rid of that a little bit but it does have a little bit of a hump in it and that kind of annoys me and it is pretty thick right in here so what I'm gonna do is try to tweeze it up a little bit more to make it look a little less thicker in the um, parting area because right in here it's pretty thick you know it's really really thick in that area and I don't like that so I'm gonna have to fix that up and try to make it but I don't want to tweeze too much out of it yeah you know. so what do you guys think I like it I haven't really seen too many people doing a video on this one yet but I really do like it I love the color you know I love my blondes and um, let me guys let me know what you guys think below and um, please make sure that you comment, rate, and subscribe. And if you haven't done that already, and I'm hoping that you guys are having a wonderful, blessed day whenever and wherever you're watching this. Um, also, as you know, I'm going to say, make sure that you uh, check out the links that I have below for some of my favorite charities. I will leave a few there where you could always donate to your favorite charity. Sometimes we forget that we need to help others. It's always good to help other people. It's so a wonderful thing that we are able to do as humans, and that is help each other. So I will see you guys in the next video, and have a great day. Infinite love and gratitude.